The following video may contain sensitive topics. The views and opinions of the presenter to these are plainly his own. Furthermore, any and all views and opinions of the presenter do not in any way reflect the views, opinions, statements, and advocacies of his personal contacts, his family, his affiliations, and his profession. While the presenter makes a commitment that all content is original, he is obliged to cite references or acknowledge resources mentioned or used in the production of this video. This disclaimer is also written in the description below. Hi, I'm Ian Vignon, an independent media practitioner, freelance writer, and content creator. And this is the Vaccine Vlog Part 2. Location reveal basically is the Bacoro Coliseum um, vaccination facility. So, may mga madre din pala magpapabakuna ngayon ng second dose. Good morning mga sister. A few moments later. Well, uh, <laughs> this is the long wait. So, namin kami medyo maga kami ng pila but then again, everyone has to wait their turn so I'm in a better situation ngayon uh, yeah, hindi, hindi ako nag-data ngayon and uh, full path and all that uh, mukhang marami-rami na rin na naka first dose ngayon ha? kaya siguro din nadubog ngayon but then again uh, yun nga we'll see what happens Wala na. Moments later. Ito na yung ano, ma matagal na hintayan nasa pader na ako. Likod na itong pader na ito, likod na to. So, um, syempre pinarioritize yung mga ano, um, mga top priorities at senior citizens, mga uh, PWDs, uh, essential workers, uh, etc. And um, it's a good thing. Mabuti naman at naano nila yun. And as I mentioned earlier, nasa, ano ako, nasa Bacor Coliseum ako ngayon. Ito yung vaccination facility na pinakamalapit sa loob namin. This is basically, uh, <laughs> this is basically Kong TV's code. <laughs> Kaya, yun lang. <laughs> yun lang masasabi ko. Uh, he played here. Kung alam niyo yung Kong's Unbelievable Basketball. <laughs> uh, dito nagsimula yun. <laughs> Gago! Anyway, Basically, this is a sacred ground for TT fans. So, yun lang ang ko, Team Payaman fans. So, yun lang. Uh, uh, as I mentioned earlier as well, ano, uh, may mga madre din na nag-aano dito, magpapavaccinate din. Pero, maya-maya pa sila. Mga 2 hours from now, uh, the, based on the queue of this, ano, of this, uh, uh, based on this queue, gano'ng karami ang tao nandito ngayon and uh, it's pretty it's a pretty good thing na ano na uh, maraming pupila para sa ano para sa COVID-19 vaccine as I mentioned in the part 1 uh, sana po eh hindi na tayo ano hindi na tayo mag ano uh, maging pihikan sa, pag sa mga bakuna as much as possible uh, kung anong available i-take ninyo kasi makakatulong din yun kahit konti so, uh, but then again uh, kahit na fully vaccinated na kayo please, ano, please follow uh, health protocols pa rin please follow um, uh, safe manage management measures and all that and syempre ano, syempre alagaan nyo rin ang sarili niyo. <laughs> So, yun lang. So, yun mga kababayan. I'm fully vaccinated, pero ingat pa rin tayo. Ingat pa rin tayo. And, uh, itutuloy ko na lang to pag uwi ko na Intrepid HQ. More moments later. And we're back in Intrepid HQ. So, naka-ano ako, naka-t-shirt lang ako. Kasi, biglang natanggal yung ano, yung, ah, uh, 
yung cotton pero ramdam ko na yung ano eh ramdam ko na yung bigat ng braso ko eh talagang that's one of the side effects and uh, that's how it goes so yun talagang ano yun talagang nangyari so um, it is what it is so yun lang mga kababayan uh, hindi ko alam kung paano ko to isasummarize but uh, you see mga kababayan there are doubts about the effectivity of vaccines lalong lalo na at um, medyo deadly yung delta variant ng COVID-19 and as um, as mentioned in part 1 eh, marami nagsasabi na ang effectivity nito ay dun lang sa vanilla virus at hindi dun sa mga uh, uh, variant na strains nun especially delta and um in where I live right now eh medyo okay naman kami kaya lang syempre uh, there's still precaution when it comes to uh, going out lalong lalo na around around this place around this hood kasi there are fears there are fears and there are speculations that A, there's already a Delta variant of COVID-19 here in our islands. B, because of that, eh, magpapatupad sila ng mga uh, lockdown restrictions at the very least for two weeks. Or C, pareho. And uh, to be honest, I think it's I think now is the right time to do so if magla-lockdown talaga sila. Kasi... Some of uh, some people in the econo- economics industry or uh, some economists believe na kapag pinigilan pa yung lockdown at this point in time at this point na ano na parang July August pa lang manageable pa yung lockdown ano eh, lockdown period dito dahil maulan hindi rin naman makakalabas sa mga tao and uh, quite honestly eh alam mo naman parang may mabuti rin dahilan kung bakit ano kung bakit kailangan ano nakasas loob lang sila ng bahay uh, every time or uh, at this time rather kesa naman uh, sa bear months pa mag ano mag lockdown and uh, alam niyo naman pag bear months dito sa Pilipinas sobrang laki it's a big event i mean Basta pagdating ng bear months, everyone's on a rush to uh, basically make some gains economically. Anyway, uh, ayun nga, I just wanted to make this uh, quick. Uh, at ayun nga, uh, we're fully vaccinated. Sabi sa amin, eh, two weeks ang hihintayin bago maging fully effective ang second dose ng bakuna. And then we'll be Uh, fully vaccinated legit so if ever there are booster doses in the future I would take that as uh, that's for sure pero sa ngayon at the very least eh, protektado na ako and uh, may kasama din ako na nagpabakuna and that's uh, that's father general and mother superior basically my parents so uh nagpabakuna kami ng tatlo and uh, ayun nga uh, we're all good so ang ano ko lang kung sakali man na merong booster doses uh, I would take it I would really take it uh, uh, mahirap na na hindi mo take yun kasi marami na mamatay eh and it's, it's ano and um, I don't really wanna buy those uh BS uh, conspiracy theories about um, about this pandemic as much as I know as much as it sounds uh, alarming as much as it sounds legit I know eh uh, medyo ano eh medyo magtatanong ka rin sa sarili mo totoo ba to? as much as possible mga kababayan please get vaccinated. Kung talagang gusto natin ng maskless December, maskless na Pasko, uh, this December, uh, I think we should be able, we should uh, do our job, do our part to uh, 
to make that possible. So, uh, syempre, there's the standard health protocols, hugas ng kamay, wear protective gear, uh, such as masks and all that, distancing, uh, distancing. We've been socially distant for the longest time and uh, maybe we can be still socially close but physically distant. Please lang, distancing mga kababayan. Paki, ano, paki, ano lang, paki, <laughs> uh, maintain lang ang distansya, okay? I'm getting paranoid kapag may, may lumal, pag malapit sa akin na hindi ko kilala, okay? And I guess uh, a lot of people are are having the same feeling as well. So, yun lang naman mga kababayan. Just uh, make sure that uh, minimum health protocols are being kept. Uh, magpabakuna kayo please lang mga kababayan please get jabbed and um, of course uh, let's do our best na ma ano talaga natin to matagumpayan natin tong uh, COVID-19 pandemic na to uh, so I guess that's all that I have to say at this moment and uh, I ko alam kung ano magiging susunod na video ko. The only thing that you need to do right now is to bear with me. That's number one. Number two, if you haven't subscribed yet, I'm not sure what why why in the world are you here and you're not yet subscribed. Click that red button right now and ring the notification bell by selecting all. Uh, <laughs> it would really help me out with uh, the algorithm. Uh, that's for sure. At um, kung sa kali lang naman na ano, sobrang generous kayo. I do have a Patreon and Buy Me a Coffee um, account. I do have those two accounts. Uh, uh, I would link them in the description below as well. Uh, I flash ko rin siya sa end, no? sa end credits. Pero yun nga, if you're very generous, $1 a month or 50 pesos a month is not too much to ask. Kung yun lang ang kaya nyo every month, wala akong, walang problema sa akin. I would absolutely appreciate everything that you would uh, that you would give to me. Whether uh, whether a comment, whether a, whether a subscription to this channel, or if you're generous enough uh, being a patron or being a member of my Buy Me A Coffee uh, uh, account, bala na, I would... I would leave it all to you, okay? Uh, I would leave it all to you and uh, I hope that um, you would be helping me out. And uh, this is a perk. If you're a Patreon or someone who has uh, subscribed to us in Buy Me A Coffee or donate to us to Buy Me A Coffee, you will be part of the legit intrepid gang, okay? Yun ang masasabi ko. I don't have any promises yet, pero we'll cross that bridge when we get there. So, yun lang. Anyway, with all that said, this is Ian reminding you to, at all times, be the salt of the earth and the light of the world. Until then, look alive, stay alive, get job, and thank you for watching. See you next time. Ian out.